What up, what up everyone? It's a Friday here in Bangkok, it's roughly around 10 p.m. Starting the video right here near Central World. It's pretty uh pretty quiet. Pretty quiet. But I'm not gonna film here. I just want to start the video here. I'm actually walking straight and I'm gonna head under a bridge and we're gonna head to an area called Siam or something like that and just check it out. I was walking through that area during the day and it seemed pretty active. I was thinking to myself, okay, this area might be a nice place to visit at night. And then I got a recommendation. Shout out to Candy from Vietnam. She said you should check it out. So that's what we'll do. Hey, I just wanted to make a quick detour, but they're jamming over here. This is a mall. Like right, it's a club. Look like a young, the younger crowd over here. Definitely, uh, we'll walk through it though. Yeah. All right, let me talk over this. Shout out to. Oh, don't copyright me, YouTube. Don't copyright me, YouTube. I thought Vietnam, I thought they party in Vietnam, they party out here too. Hold on. Hey, entry's free too. You don't even have to, uh, you, you can just come in and stand here. This is where we're headed to, Siam. Well, not this building, but you see the name Siam. Right up there. See some lights up here. Let's see uh, what's going on. And judging by the the vibe, I don't know if it's gonna be a bougie, a bourgeois vibe. I don't know if it's gonna be a little bit more, uh, a little less tame or, or what, we'll see. But uh, I think this is where everything starts over here. Oh, I don't know if I should go in the mall again. They might be turning up in here. We'll we'll skip it. We'll, we'll skip it. We'll walk straight. Uh, let me get in front of everybody. Oh, there we go. Can head up there, up to the skywalk. We'll keep going straight. And this is the this is the company I went with AIS. I don't know if they're the best or not, but highly recommended. Oh, this is pretty nice. We'll go up this way. I don't know if we can go up this way. Look at this. You can find some peace and tranquility in the middle of the of the city. Right over here. Yeah, this is nice. Give me uh, some South Beach vibes. You're walking on Ocean Drive, they have the trees wrapped in Christmas lights. Yeah, I think this is more some Gucci stores, Zara, Zara, however you pronounce it. Oh, it's blocked off. Uh, I think we can squeeze through there. Oh man, hopefully I'm not intruding. I think I'm gonna just, uh, oh, it's a private property. Okay, let me squeeze through over here. Okay, look at this. Station right there. 
Let me give you guys one tip. The traffic here is ridiculous. I don't like riding motorbikes, but I had to. I had to make an exception for this trip. So I've been riding motorbikes around, which uh, it, you have to. Otherwise, you're going to be in traffic for a long time, especially during rush hour. The motorbikes, they can weave in and, in and out of traffic. Or if you don't want to do that, you can catch this right here. They have like LRT, MRT, BTT. They have trains and subways basically. And you can catch that right there. Whoops right through traffic. The Sky Train, there you go right there. Sky Train, that's the name. You get you to most places in the city, in the center, at least right there. Sky Train. Oh, we're gonna head back down. People posted, chilling, relaxing. Oh. This is the view that they see right over here. For the record, this area isn't super, super large, but it is nice and beautiful. That's the strip we just walked. I came here during the daytime. Daytime, definitely a lovely place. Great place to get shade because they have these structures over here. Let's see what everyone else is looking at. Let's go over here. Yeah, this area is pretty tame. I think that club was an outlier. I could be wrong. There could be uh, more spots over there. I'm gonna walk the other side. Pretty sure you can keep going down this way, but we're gonna go left side, strong side. Walk down here, see the vibe of some of the rock, um, some of the, damn, I forgot I was gonna say, some of the shops, eateries on the side, and just see what they have. Look like uh, they might be closing the shop though. Oh, the best dessert in the world. Mango sticky rice. What am I saying? They're not closing up. This is Bangkok. Let's check this. Quickly walk through all of this. Oh, God. let me see if I can get through. <laughs> Uh, 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 oh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Oh, thank you. Uh, excuse me. Hey, I hate walking behind people because all you see is their back. So I think it in front of everyone. Sugarcane juice. Yeah, one of a thousand night markets. Break and eat, shop, bargain, barter, all that stuff. That was just a quick walk through the night market. I'm gonna go a little farther up because I saw like a large group of people in one area. I wanna see what that's about. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. See what they got over here. I thought I saw some people. Well, I'll double check, verify. Uh, I think a uh, false alarm. Yeah, I think there was a false alarm. I, okay, we'll probably, yeah, we're gonna turn around. 
Yeah, it was a false alarm. It was a false alarm, so I'm gonna head back over there where all the lights are, take a right, and then see what was on the other side of the strip, on the other side of the bridge. You go this way, pretty dark. Gonna head back this way. All right, I'm back along the strip. Earlier during the week, I came to this area. It was a little bit more active. It looked like uh, shops closed early on this part, on this side. Hopefully not. Yeah, look, let me, uh, uh, let me walk over here and see what the deal is. It looks pretty, I don't know, maybe there's some secret spots over here. Let's find out. Because during the day, like I said, these uh these side streets were pretty busy. It looked like right now they're not too busy. Yeah guys, the the street was closed. I think, uh, I think this area is pretty chill. It's pretty chill. No, nothing wrong with that. They have more nightlife areas, definitely for sure. This is uh, more, I'll say, family friendly. Maybe a little bourgeois as well. I guess you would say this is the shopping district. One of these shopping districts, definitely. One of the shopping districts, definitely. And during the day, it's very super active. And for anybody who's, who's wondering, saying, hey, slide, you gotta go to this nightlife spot, this nightlife spot, keep in mind I have a camera. <laughs> you know, so if you're gonna give recommendations, keep that in mind. I'm not trying to film, uh, uh, I'm not trying to get, <laughs> you guys, you guys get it. You know, they got websites for the, the X-rated stuff, if you know what I mean. I'm trying to keep this uh, PG-12, PG-12. But I'm gonna end it right here. Like I said, not a super large area, but definitely very beautiful, very, very uh, aesthetic. A lot of lovely lights and shops, little night market, all that good stuff. It's around 10:30 right now, so the the night, the the fun stuff hasn't begun yet. It's around. Uh, can I cross right here? Oh uh, no, they actually have a stairway. It's around 10:30ish, so people. No, people are still warming up right now. People are still warming up. This is just a, a teaser. Just a quick teaser into Bangkok after dark. But walking back to the room, I'm going to end it. Appreciate you guys watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope for some of you guys who were with me along this video, you like what you saw. Give you a different, uh, different area to visit. But anyways, all oh, us hand back this way is a lot nicer. But anyways, I'm in it right here. Deuces.